All right. Um, what do I want to do? Oh, right. The one thing I was going to show off before. Uh, the Book of Ryu. Some key items, right. Over 10 areas visited. Over 20 areas visited. Five hours. Oh, there we go. For now, it only clocks the number of areas I've visited and the time I've been playing. Which, so far, is not very long. But it creates bonus stuff that we get to listen to. As such, I unlocked, like, the first movie, I got some music, and I can actually see those at the, uh, uh, on the desktop. I can't watch the movies until after I beat the game, because, obviously. Um, I guess with that taken care of, it was actually really quick. Let's go see if we can wrap up uh, the Miss Gardenia fan club side plot real quick. Actually, now that we've got Sandro, we can actually call him in. Ore Sanjo Sanjiro. Oh, he's now level 15. Oh, it's you. Apparently he got some levels while he was fucking in there when between now and then. Alright. I like that he somehow already knows my name. Alright, let's head off. Where everybody knows your name. Ah, one of these places. This is a place we haven't seen before. So, this is an interesting case where it's not actually a free roam field, but the field is very much styled like a dungeon. You don't see too many of these, at least I don't think so. They still have, like, fields and others. They still have, like, uh, enemies and stuff like that, like magic portals and whatnot. But it's just less likely to see them than the other ones. Um, Sandro, do you have any skills? You have Hayabusa, Reps, and a bunch of lowering stuff. Huh, that is concerning. How many equipment I could give you? Nothing that would, nothing that would matter. If I still had one of the uh, Nodachis, I'd give you that. Play that game, fine by me. Now, unfortunately, like an actual dungeon, though, I have to use a fairy orb to figure out where the hell I'm going. So, thankfully, nothing too bad. Some of these can go on for fucking ever, though. You know which? Uh. And to move at sonic speed. You look pretty tough. Please give this to Miss Gardenia. Do I have to? Love letter for Gardenia. No, I don't want it. It's not for you. Please be careful with it. And don't you dare throw it away. How about you ladies, uh... I was gonna say man up, but w woman up? Suck it up. There we go. Go do it yourself. 
Is Miss Gardenia in the back? Let's go. God, you are such a pushover. Side note, can I just say, I'm really sad that most of these characters will not, like, show up again. You have to be strong to follow Miss Gardenia. Like, they were apparently important enough that they all got voice actors. Miss Gardenia went deep into the dungeon alone. But as far as I know, you can't encounter them in town like other NPCs. Same with, like, other characters that we come across. Like the ninja-looking dude that, um... That tells us that he got turned away in that one in the first corrupted field we go to. Miss Gardenia, please return safely. It's like these guys were important enough that they got voice acting and actual names, but not important enough that we don't see them running around afterwards. It's kind of really weird. Let's figure out where the hell I'm going. Oh, I'm just going straight. Oh, there's a lot of you. Gardenia? Oh. You seem to have no manners. Oh, I'm sorry. Are you Miss Gardenia? Yes, I am. What do you want? Someone asked me to give this letter to you. You kidding me? Those girls couldn't get past one fucking fight with a couple wizards? You fucking joking? What level are they? Someone? I guess she's a fan of yours. No, thank you. I should run after her. No, you really shouldn't. I mean, if I didn't already know, spoiler, we're going to get uh, Gardenia's member address after this, uh, that we would be doing it, I would honestly just turn away, because it's like, it's not your place to fucking force this letter on this poor girl. She has a uh, fucking ravenous fans after her. It's not your business. Just fucking let the, let the crazies have their moment. Just stay in the dungeon. They clearly can't come after her. She's trying to hide from them because she has nowhere else to go. It's not actually true, but it's funny to imagine that that's why she's here. I think she's actually here for a purpose. I don't remember. Leave me alone. But I promised. They must have forced this upon you. Yes, they actually did. Well, you could say that. See, even Kite agrees. Then it's not really a promise. Forget about it. I like Gardenia. Like, thinking-wise. You know, I don't know how she keeps running ahead of us. I have a speed charm on. How is she getting farther than us? How do magic portals work in dungeons in this game? Oh, well, Sandro's dead. Huh. There we go. Oh, we're on the next level, right. Time to use another fairy orb. I have to buy more of these eventually. Take the, take the road of least resistance. Mostly because I don't need the experience from the fighting. It's like, I think it'll be a hot minute before I encounter anything that's too powerful for me. There we go. God, I think this has... Four floors? I think it's only four. Hope it's only Sit four. Yourself. You know, it's really weird now that I think about it. For an MMO game, there's no PvP in this game. But that's like a huge thing for like the spiritual success. Well, I say spiritual successor, but it's technically the successor series. Uh, Dot Hack GU. That it's like, oh, P like PKers or player killers are a like ravenous thing going on. But it's like, Playing the actual original, like, Dot Hack, it's... You don't ever hear anyone about, like, people getting killed by other players. I think they apply it in, like, Dot Hack's sign. 
Okay, well, never mind. I was gonna say they imply it. I was like, oh wait, Sora exists. <laughs> but I don't think there's like a big thing about it in the actual games about, uh, about actually like uh, player killing and stuff like that. Is she in this one or the other one? Nope, she's here. All right, it's dead. You are surprisingly strong. Very well. I will accept it under two conditions. One, you will join my party when I summon you. And second, do not call me Miss. That is all. All right. Can I call you Mistress? All right, then. I'll be using an item to escape. Since those girls are probably waiting for me on B1. Yeah, probably. Was Miss Gardenia okay? You did give her the letter, right? What? She used an item to get back? Shocker, it's almost like someone wouldn't want to trudge the three floors to get out of a dungeon. You guys, we're off to Root Town! You mean the Root Town? Seriously, two Root Town just sounds weird. Right on! <laughs> I feel like Sandra would just be right next to me like, This is why I don't get women. Well, that insanity aside, I think now we'll go help out Pyrus with his thing, mostly because I think it's the main plot to go help him with his shit. Oh, I have four yellow candies. Holy shit. Keep the flame axe. Give it to... Uh... Give that to... Uh... Hmm. Ugh. There we go, I had something stuck in my throat. Uh, give that to uh, Pyrus. We're gonna actually disband the party. Thanks for everything. You're welcome, Steve Bloom. I love you. You're my favorite Wolverine. You're my favorite Transformer. My favorite whatever the hell else you're for. My favorite creepy snake pedophile. Boy, that's a sentence I didn't expect to say today. Uh, let's see, how am I doing for... Uh, fine there. Antidotes? Uh, fine. Fine. Got my four resurrects just because. There we go. Alright, let's invite Gardenia. It's you. I'm on my way. I mean, I could have sworn that her thing was that she would join, that I would join her, not the other way around, but hey, uh, whatever. Hark. He apparently, Pyros has no problem being seen with his orange armor if it's in a root town, but apparently going on a journey, that's a problem. Also, our noble Grunty's just hanging out here. Oh, mon ami. He still has a, oh, he has a Treeman Spear. Aside from that, he has pretty basic stuff. Do you want... no? Okay. Do you want a... no? No. Do you want, you want an anything? Do you want the death? No? Okay. We'll, we'll come back. We'll talk terms. Alright, actually, now that we have Gardenia, uh, I'm going to withdraw. That fucking berserk spear I took. There we go. What? Give it to her. Got it. I'll make you. And Pyro says. Oh, there he is. I, I was like. Oh. I cannot continue on my journey like this. 
I can't give him the weapon because he wants me to help him with his quest. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's go solve your problem, buddy. Oh, get on my back. Wordless, putrid, hot-blooded, scaffold. Just actually finally catching up to me in levels. I might need to go uh, level grind a little bit. At least after this recording session. Nothing too bad right now. Alright, cool. Can I talk to you? The silver white? We search more carefully. Or are you perhaps thinking that this is of no importance? That is not what I said at all. I was trying to give you an item, but hey, whatever. Fuck you, I guess. Mushroom. I didn't actually know he gave that dialogue, though. That was pretty funny. Oh, yeah, I didn't bring this up. Uh, Gardenia is a heavy arm. It, not heavy arm. Uh, she is a long arm. It's basically a fancy way of saying someone who uses a spear. Mushrooms. I don't really have much else to say about their stats. I don't really know anything about it. I, I don't, I don't really know. <laughs> Ow. All right, so we gotta look for the crap for a fucking Pyros. Uh, if I recall, this actually spans quite a bit. Invisible egg. I can't remember. I want to say this maybe takes us across to multiple dungeons, and I really, really hope I'm wrong about that. Like, I really hope I'm wrong. All these things. Thankfully, nothing too bad right now. I'm still pretty easy to murder. You have quite a bit of experience, though. Oh, never mind. Just to Gardenia. Gardenia, what level are you? Gardenia, why are you level 10? Well, Gardenia, consider this boot camp. Invisible egg. Invisible egg. This is a very straightforward dungeon, and I don't know how to feel about it. Or at least this floor is. Fucking snake designed this fucking, uh, this floor? Oh, no, there we go. Finally hit some, uh, divergence. Alright. Show me the way. Ah, there are no enemies on this floor. I'm hoping, I'm hoping this isn't a case where I have to, like, check every single treasure box to try and find the item. I'm fairly sure if I'm going to find it, it's going to be in the god statue. He hopes and prays. Oh, no. This is totally going to be how it goes. Please, give it to me. Spoiler, guess what happens? Let's look elsewhere. Yeah, that's the gimmick of this. There are fake remedies! And I don't remember if you have to get all the fake remedies to get through this or not. I really hope not! Ah, 
I really hope that I just have to get to the GOT statue and get the item. I really hope that's the case. I would question how Mia did this, but considering she has a hacked PC and all that, you know, I'm not too surprised. But I'm more surprised that Pyros, with his hacked music and hacked uh, head, can't fix that. There we go. Oh, hey, Gardenia's dead. That's a problem. Hold on, don't worry, I got your back. No matter what, I got your back. I take a bullet for you if it comes to that. Oh, that's right, he can attack himself, I forgot. I don't know how that works, but he can while he's under the effect of the lovers. Who's that, Gardenia? You leveled up. Way to go. Alright, which way am I going? Uh, I'm just gonna go to the God Statue and hope I don't need the others. Invisible egg. I'm gonna pray that's all I have to do. Alright, this is definitely where the God Statue should be. Oh, there it is. Like, I didn't feel like changing the camera to find it. It's probably gonna be behind that monster portal there, though, if I'm gonna take a wild guess. Yeah, Fireman's Code. It's not actually in the God Statue. That's interesting. Gun Masher! To cruise! Oh, wait, it's fire tolerant. Damn, I wasn't paying attention. I'll just hit this guy. Oh, that's good. The uh, the other thing was dead. Okay. I don't know why. I thought it was still alive. Oh, that was not the item. All right, then. Maybe in one of the other two rooms. I hope. You can see why I call this section the padding section. Because that's really what we're doing here. Nothing is technically advancing the plot. It's just... Um, what is it? Uh, Elk was having a moment. Uh, Pyrrhos is, is under distress for seemingly no reason. Like, as far as I know, he just asked for a love potion from Mia for whatever reason. feel a little stronger. I think he's back to his first color. Oh no, he's yellow this time, not gold. Or orange, whatever. Oh god, no. Uh, <laughs> oh no. I have to search every room of this goddamn dungeon. I no longer want to live on this plane of existence anymore. Oh. Sweet. I'm so thankful that I'm already a high enough level I don't have to worry about actually dealing with these enemies. True remedy, please, please be this actually. Must be the one. I'm sure it is. Actually, if I if I recall, I think this actually turns him back to his original to uh being orange again. Whoa, whoa. Uh, 
Well, almost. Yeah. Uh, I hate this area. I don't hate the area. I just hate this mission. It's so boring. <laughs> Nothing's happening. Sweet. that they can't get over that thing's body. Oh shit, I'm almost dead. There we go. I mean, not like I'm missing out on any sweet experience or anything like that. Oh no. I have to go search the first floor. <laughs> Torture me. Unicron! Why do you torture me? You have failed. No, Unicron. Ultra Magnus is dead, and Dot Hack Infection lay with it. No, you are a fool. Ultra Magnus lives, and the infection with him. Go to the planet of junk and destroy the dot hack of infection. I swear to God, if I am forced to clear out this entire invisible egg. fucking invisible dungeon, egg. It, it has got to be that item invisible over there. It has literally got to be it. It's the only other one by itself. There you go, attack yourself, dumbass. It actually is attacking itself, it's beautiful. Stop hitting yourself, stop hitting yourself. <laughs> We've been here long enough, my speed charm wore off. area. Thank God. Hmm? I'm back! Good for you. Yes, I'll give you this to show my appreciation. Oh, Joy. Thank you. May the stars shine upon you! Kill me. Just kill me. All right, what, what did this fucking item he give me do? <laughs> Magical attack parameter by negative one. <laughs> oh god, I can't. Oh. Life has no meaning. Oh god, test version of the world. Oh, uh, let's see. True player committed suicide during the test period, but it had nothing to do with the game. Uh, this game called Fragment in magazine from two years ago. That's the one title on the menu design change with the game itself seemed to be the uh, same. Oh, and some items were also deleted. Virus. 
There have been some weird problems ever since the last air problem. I wonder what's up. Some people say it's a virus. It's an infection. Let's game, dead to game, back to game. What's your name? The Boaster. Oh yeah, this is the uh, mention of the eggs and where to find them. I mean, I've already been picking up some of them, so I'm not too worried about that myself. I've got mail. Black Rose actually messaged me some. We went to the dungeon, quiet eternal white devil. Uh, nothing was there, right? I thought it was a hoax, so I emailed him. Um, Marin, was it? Well, anyways, I emailed her. She wouldn't reply to me, but I kept pestering her, and guess what? Someone changed those keywords. She was freaked out about it, too. The actual keywords are cursed, despaired, paradise. So, someone interfered with the BBS to keep, uh, to keep... BBS? Yeah. Saying BBS always sounds weird. Uh... Uh, always sounds weird. Uh, anyways, someone interfered with it to uh, ensure that people wouldn't find the actual area. K okay, Curioso. But I think with that, we're going to call things an end for now. So I'm gonna do some light training off uh, off the way, and when we come back, uh, I guess things will happen. So until then, I will catch you all later. Asta.